record the buzzer, that's even harder. Uh, but our players went 26 and 8. They uh, tied the school record for winning. And, and uh, we went into the season losing our top leading, our two leading scorers, Tajidi and, and Evan Mobley. Uh, and, and these guys really stepped up. We brought some new guys in, the four freshmen, and, and uh, uh, Boogie is a transfer and the returning players. They took ownership of the team, and uh, they were a lot of fun to coach. They worked, they worked very, very hard. They had the, a winning spirit, and they learned how to win games. And, and uh, you, you look at our season, we had a lot of close games. Uh, and they won uh, uh, most of them. I think we were 10-1 before the NCAA tournament, five points or less. I know we had a couple other ones that, that we lost by seven or eight uh, when we had a foul. But to go 10-1 and in five-point games, they, they knew how to win. They just made winning plays down the stretch. And in college basketball, the margin of error of winning and losing is very, very small. As you see that March Madness, anything can happen once you get to March Madness. That, 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 uh, whether it's a foul call or a bad out-of-bounds call or a missed free throw or a missed layup, uh, the, the margin gets so small at this level. And, and our guys figured out how to win the last couple years, and this year was incredible. We are losing a, a, quite a few guys. There's, there's a super opportunity going into next year for, for some of our attorneys. Uh, to, to uh, take over, take more ownership of this team. It's really exciting. That's what college basketball is all about. You, you have a limited time to be here at, 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 in college, and uh, so so it's exciting for for some of our players are returning. We expect to be very good next year. The, the funny thing is, not funny, but uh, when I started here nine years ago, we coached Capco and uh, our staff. Uh, you know, no, no Southern California kids were even on. We had one Southern California kid on our roster. And, uh, and, and when you go 2-16 and 16 in the Pac-12, it's not a lot of fun. Yeah, and then the next year, we really improved to 3-15. and 15. We were great that next year. <laughs> but now, now, we expect to win every game we play when we step on the court. And based on some of your emails and texts after we lose, I think the fans do too, right? <laughs> Uh, but it, it's, uh, it's been remarkable to see these uh, young men, especially on this year's team, uh, win so many games and, and, and really enjoy the experience of being a USC student athlete. Uh, we have some awards uh, before we go to the highlight video, so we're going to put a